Hi there, I'm Eitan, and welcome back to Wix Wiz. Uh, today I'm going to be talking about activating the simple privacy and cookies banner on your Wix website. And this is something that's really important because there are different countries that uh, regulate these kinds of stuff. And if you're doing business in those countries uh, and you don't want to get uh, screwed over, then you'll want to have these uh, privacy and cookie banners. Um, and it's something that people have come to expect uh, whenever they land on a new website. So let's get started. So I'm here in my Wix dashboard, and you can see here from the top that I am in settings and privacy and cookies. Um, if you're not sure, you could just take a look here in the search bar and find uh, privacy and cookies. Uh, and you see uh, several options here, and I'm really gonna be talking about the first option, which is to uh, display a cookie consent banner. Um, and so I'm just gonna click over here to get started. And now I can make some different choices about, you know, how my banner will look. So first of all, I'm just going to say display cookie banner on site. Uh, and now you could see here, it's quite small, but you could see kind of like a, um, a rendering of what it might look like. Uh, and I can choose, let's say dark, uh, which actually looks kind of good on my site uh, or customize. Uh, and I can kind of choose different colors and stuff here. I'm actually going to just going to go with the dark one. I like the way that looks. Um, and then we have privacy policy link text. Uh, so this is a link that will go to a page that's your privacy policy, which I actually don't have on my site yet. Um, but maybe I should set that up. Um, uh, and here you have options for a decline all button. That means they don't accept any of the cookies. And then add cookie setting widget to all pages. So this will display it uh, on every single page of the website, which I'm not going to do because I think that that would probably be pretty annoying. Uh, here you can um, kind of write the custom text of what your cookie banner will say. So that's what's right over here. Uh, and I'm going to write, uh, I work really hard to improve my site. And to do that, I need some information about how people use it, okay? And then I can let people um, kind of say yes or no. And I, I think it's quite important to um, kind of think of something unique here um, and out of the box. And if you go to some other sites and you can find some that kind of try to go a little out of the box with these things, uh, because it really can improve uh, the experience of something which is otherwise quite a crappy user, user experience. Uh, like some kind of pop-up on the page, which you just have to put there. Um, here for the uh, privacy policy, uh, here it's probably going to give me some issues because I don't have a page set up. Uh, I'm just going to say that it should go for now to the contact me page. Oh, it doesn't let me. Uh, please choose a page to link to your privacy policy info. Uh, let's see if there's a page that I can connect here. Maybe I'll just say external web address, <clears throat> and then I'll say privacy. Maybe I need to put the HTTPS here. OK, so that worked. Even though this page does not exist on my site, uh, at least it'll let me submit the form. Uh, and later on, I can kind of deal with this. Uh, but for now, people will just be taken to a 404 page. Uh, which is okay. Um, okay, and then review cookie policy requirements, uh, the standard cookie banner. So what kind of, you know, what, what it does basically. Uh, they want, Wix kind of just wants to make sure that you know what's going on with this banner and what it does. Uh, and you can go ahead and, and read it. And this is going to be really important because uh, in my next video, I'm going to be dealing with a... Um, kind of some custom code that we're injecting for analytics uh, with Hotjar. And this is something that we're going to want to let people uh, either consent to or opt out of. So I'm going to go ahead and say, I've read and understood the above. And here we have some um, advanced options. <clears throat> um, OK, so this is if we want to send out kind of a uh, renewal of the consent. Uh, if we've made some changes for now, I'm not going to get into that. Um, and just deal with the basic setup. So 
that's pretty much uh, all I have to do. And then I just go ahead and save and publish. And we're good. So I'm going to go to the live site. Um, so welcome to my website. I've actually been updating it recently. And now you can see that we have the, um, the cookie banner here. And I can go ahead and click Accept. And now uh, any kind of you know analytics or custom code or third-party apps or stuff like that will start to run on my site. And if we set them up correctly in the custom code, uh, then they would not run if I did not consent. Um, so that's the basics of setting up a cookie banner in Wix. It's quite straightforward, um, but some people might forget about it because it's kind of something that you have to turn on. Um, and yeah, if you like this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.